Want to get started selling on Amazon, but not sure how much money you need or where to start? By the end of this video, you're going to have the exact system I use to help calculate the profitability of your Amazon product. This is the thought process that I went through to be able to validate this product to make sure that's even worth selling in the first place. First of all, I had to go source the product, source the caps, the bottles, and then the aloe vera itself, as well as the peppermint oil. So this product cost me $4.04 .04 landed, including the label, the cap, the bottle, and the aloe vera gel peppermint oil itself. I see my competitors selling it anywhere from you know, $12 to $25 for a bottle this size. So I'm landing around $15. I'm aiming to sell this product for $15. My initial order was for 1,000 units, so that cost me $4,040 to launch this product. It generated about $15,000 in sales in my first week. And the first day of launching it actually generated over $6,000. So total profit after Amazon fees, after fulfillment fees, gives me about $5.20 profit, which means I just netted over $5,000 in a week selling this product on Amazon. So obviously it is a, a profitable product. It sold out within the first week. So for this specific product, out of the gate, obviously landed cost, the cost per unit is $4.04. .04. Typically for products, I like to aim for at least a 30% profit margin. So this one lands us at about 33%, just slightly over, so that's great. Obviously the more profit we can make, the better. And then in terms of other costs that might be associated, you might want to look at PPC. What are the costs per click? So on average for the specific niche, we were averaging anywhere from a dollar to you know, $1.75 um, for this specific product. So minus all of those costs, it lands you at this amount here. We'll get back to it in one second. All of this content is free. So if you're enjoying this video, let us know by smashing the like button, back to it. So the cost of goods sold is essentially how much your product costs in total from everything from your, you know, for this product specifically, we have caps, we have bottles, we have the aloe vera gel and peppermint oil um, and the labels. So we don't have a box for that, so that's not gonna be an added cost, but essentially whatever the cost of all the materials and the cost for your manufacturer to put that together, that's gonna be your total cost of goods sold. This is also known as your CPU, which is your cost per unit. So if you're new and you're trying to determine whether a product is worth selling or not, first thing you wanna do is figure out if it's profitable. How you do that, find out how much it's gonna cost, whether you're sourcing it in the States and you are able to contact a manufacturer to get a quote, or maybe you're sourcing from overseas. If it's a product that is not going on your skin or in your body, you might be sourcing overseas. You can go on alibaba.com and literally find out, you know, what are the, the price ranges for a product like this and find out what the cost of the goods sold is, minus 15% from Amazon, minus your fulfillment fee, and that's gonna give you your potential profit margin. Also keep in mind marketing costs. So once you've taken all of these costs out of the equation, are you profitable? That's the question you're gonna ask yourself. So I know these numbers can be overwhelming. So what I've done is to simplify it is created a spreadsheet template to figure out what your profitability is for any product. All you have to do is plug in a couple numbers and it'll tell you what your minimum selling price should be so that you're profitable. And it'll also tell you if you're profitable in general. Some of the things that you might want to keep in mind and which will be broken down in the spreadsheet is what the average selling price is, what you would like to sell your product for. This is gonna give you a baseline because this is, what your, this is what your revenue is, and then it's going to subtract all of the relevant fees, such as your selling fee, which is 15%, your FBA fee, which is your pick and pack fee, which can range based on the size of your product and the weight of your product, as well as your cost of goods sold, which is just the overall total amount that your product costs to manufacture. Once you subtract all of these fees, you'll be able to determine whether or not your product's going to be profitable, and then you can move on with launching it. Hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure you like, subscribe, and leave a comment below to let me know what you guys want to see next. Hey guys, hope you're loving our videos and that you're getting heaps of value from them. If you are, make sure to hit the like button and make sure to subscribe to join the Founder Fam. If you did enjoy this video and want to continue to master your skills, make sure you click here to access your free training now, where we'll go into way more depth with this founder.